Hello there. What's your name? I'm Marla. Hey, I'm Whitney. Nice to meet you, Whitney. It's nice to meet you too, Marlon. I'm looking for a girlfriend. How old are you? What if I said I was 16? Then I can't date you. I'm not that type of guy. Well, how old are you? I'm 28. I turn 29 in a few days. What about you? Oh, I'm 21. I just turned 21 last month. You don't look like it. I know, I get it a lot. I have this thing that makes me look younger. I'll get out my ID to prove it. Oh no you're good. You don't have to. Oh, because I don't even have it on me. Are you sure you're 21? Yes I'm sure. Can I go to your place? I was thinking we could go to the Plotterdam Cafe, but yeah we can go to my place. Okay, that's cool. That man looks like he's kidnapping that child. I need to follow them and see where this man is going with her. So what are your favorite movies? Like what kind of movies? Black comedy, action, and animated movies. That's good. Do you have parents? Yeah, but they're not here. Oh. Well, I was hoping I could put on a movie for you and make you something to eat and drink. You like popcorn? Yeah, I do. Do I get to invite my friends over? Why say no? Yeah, you can invite your friends over. Oh, well, I don't want to. I was just asking if it was okay. Yeah, it's alright to invite your friends over. Are you comfortable with soda or water? Can I get some lemonade? Or some water? My sister drank all the lemonade, so all you have to get is water at the moment. Or soda? Oh. I like soda, but I'm going for some water. Okay. What about something to eat? It doesn't matter. I'm not really that hungry, but I am thirsty. So no food? Nope, but I might need some when I'm ready. All right. Looks like we're here with me. Tired of running. I think this is where the man is taking the woman. I have to take action immediately. Now is the perfect time to call the police. People like him need to be in prison. Damn, my phone's about to die. I better make this call quick. I have Netflix, Hulu, Peacock, everything. You decide. That's cool, Marlin. 911 Plotagon City Police Department. What is your emergency? Hey, there is this man that kidnapped this girl and he took her to his place. The girl is around her teenage years and the man is possibly in his 30s. I don't know what he's planning on doing to her but I don't like it. Okay ma'am. What are the man and the girl we are at? What's the address? The man has black hair, he looks mixed, he's wearing a light blue shirt with a picture of a sunset on it. He's also wearing blue jeans, and some black shoes. Okay. What about the girl? The girl has green hair. She's also mixed, she's wearing a large red shirt with the number 11 on the front, a khaki skirt, and some black shoes. Damn it, I know that girl. Hurry up, what's the address? The address is 2946 Plotagon Drive. Please hurry, the both of them just went inside of the man's house. Okay. We're sending the police. Just, stay on the scene. I still have questions to ask you. Yes, sir. I pray for her safety. Oh, I forgot to give you your drink. My bad. It's all good, Marlin. I'll get that. I'll be back. Okay. 
Oh hey officer, you didn't have to close the door, because I am coming in. Wait, why? I'll tell you, just let me in. Um, okay. I got a call about a kidnapping. Did you have something to do with this? And I was correct. I wasn't kidnapping her, she wanted to chill with me. Dude. How old are you? I'm 28. Why, what's going on? Nigga, that girl is 15. Why do you have a minor in your home? Wait what? She's 15? Yes she is. Then how come that girl told me she was 21? Does she look 21 to you? She told me she had this thing that makes her look younger than 21. Okay. Just to let you know I know this girl. You do? Yes. With me, come with me, you're going to the station. Wait, am I getting arrested? No you are not getting arrested, just come with me. Okay. Yo Joey, where's Whitney? I told you. She's with Tariq at the police station. The police station? What did she do? Apparently she lied about something. You know what I'm just going to tell you. She lied to a man about her age. I wish I could tell you more but that's all I know. And I was thinking, why did she even go outside in the first place without my permission? Yeah I am thinking that too. I didn't even know she went outside anyway. I told her not to go talk to strangers. And I'm pretty sure her parents told her that. And the thing is, she went out without an adult. She could have actually got kidnapped. I wanted to go with her but she said Martavius was going to be with her. Can't believe she just told you that lie. Because Florence told me Martavius just left Joe's to go to GCP with his girlfriend. Wait, what's GCP? Green Curry Plotagon. I just abbreviated it. I never knew she walked away either. I just came back from Dada's diner. Why did she walk away in the first place? Was it just to get fresh air and just walk around? Probably. I'm glad she didn't get kidnapped, but she could've. An adult needs to be with her at all times. Fifteen or not, she still needs to have an adult with her. Her brain isn't even done developing yet. Exactly. I wonder why Tariq took her to the station. Probably just to talk to her about not running away? No because usually he'll bring her back here. Well then I wonder what she did for her to go to the station with Tariq. I heard she went with an adult too. Hopefully the adult didn't do anything to her. Or... She probably didn't even go with the adult at all. We just might never know, until we find out. You know why you're in here? Not really. Well you should. You nearly got a 28 year old man arrested for lying about your age. At first he probably didn't believe you but then you told him you had something that made you appear younger than 21, and he believed you. He was unaware that you were 15 years old. You even went outside without an adult with you. 15 or not you still have to have an adult with you because something might happen to you, and you didn't even ask Joseph or anyone else to go outside. That I know of. I didn't ask them. I should've, and I should've brought an adult with me. Am I getting arrested? No, I told you you're not getting arrested. Was this your first time you lied to someone about your age? Yes. Because this is the first time this happened, it's a warning. Did the man do anything to you? No. He was going to get me a drink though. What drink? Water. He was going to get me water. Okay. Well you're free to go, just go and wait outside, I have to arrange some things here. Wait, outside outside, like outdoors? No, outside the station. Go outside the station, let me arrange some things real quick. Okay Officer Pierce. Just don't do it again please. Okay, I won't. So, did you arrest her? Does it look like I arrested her? And why would I? 
you're right. Just continue patrolling the area, Smith. Hey, Joseph. What are you doing? Fixing this time machine. It needs an update. I know I said this before, but this looks real nice. Yeah, and who made it? Me and my friend Joseph Bernard. Oh. Okay. Damn it. I don't know why, but this ain't working. And it's getting me mad. I probably need to go back and fix something I did wrong. Yeah, you probably mistyped something. Yeah, I am fast on typing, and I may mess up most times, so I'm going to fix these real quick and go back to correct some stuff I messed up on. Well anyways I was just checking on you. Let me get out of your way, so you can keep fixing the machine. I don't even know why I'm doing this. I hope Whitney learned her lesson. I don't know why she never told me she was going to go outside. Well as long as she's safe. Is Joseph working on his time machine? Yes, he is. Or he was. Well I'm glad that Whitney's back and unharmed. I heard the man was trying to date Whitney because he was looking for a girlfriend and she told him she was 21. Don't know why she told him that. She could have got the man arrested. All I'm trying to know is why she thought it was okay to go outside without getting consent from Joseph. It's no telling what would have happened to her. Luckily the man didn't do anything that I know of. She needs to know most times lying can put people in danger. Well as long as she came home safe, I'm not mad. She better not do it again, she could get in some serious trouble. <laughs>